dear wife, that's you. You know, writing this vow has made me think a lot. What has these past few years meant to me? What will the next few years look like? How has meeting you changed my life? Am I ready to completely give my heart and soul to you? As promised, what my job as your husband will be. Hug and kiss you while you're feeling down until you feel better, to make you feel beautiful, and to always have faith in us. Alan, you are my everything, my wife forever and always. We truly based our love story on walk by faith, not by sight. I knew you were the one. The day that my mom made me realize that you were making my true life come out, that she hasn't heard since I was young. I love you with everything that I am, and I'm truly blessed to become your wife today. I promise to always love you unconditionally. I promise to never give up on us, no matter how tough things may get. I promise to encourage your ambitions as you have encouraged mine. I promise to be patient with you. I promise to listen to you as your wife and your best friend and not your therapist. I promise to make you smile at least once a day. I promise to be the best wife I can be and that you deserve. And I promise to always love you for who you are. You are without a doubt in my mind, my soup snake. When I was standing there, I was thinking when you were little mm -hmm. and, you, and you would wake up. And I'd, I'd be asleep, and you'd wake up, and first, and then you would just have this big smile on your face, and you'd give me a big kiss in the morning. So happy for you. Mason's great. So proud of you. You look pretty. We are gathered this afternoon to witness the joining of Mr. Mason Valentine and Ms. Alan Parker in holy matrimony. For it's by faith two shall become one, it's by faith no other way to be. And so that is why we are here. It is not coincidence or happenstance, not even an accident, but by his will. We tried to run, but ended up in a circle, which ends where it begins. Well, who knew? Not us at the start. But God knew the whole time. He knew what we needed because he knew us when. And he knew this moment would come. It is by his power and touch that we shall never end. Mr. Valentine. Do you take Alan Parker to be your lawfully wedded wife? I do. <clears throat> and Miss Alan Parker, do you take Mason Valentine to be your lawfully wedded husband? Absolutely. Place it on her ring finger, please. Accept that by the power invested in me, by the Universal Life Church and by the state of this Mississippi, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Sir, you may salute your bride. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my honor to present to you for the first time, Mr. and Mrs. Mason and Alan Valentine.
wife forever and always. I look forward to our beautiful life together and what it will bring. I love you and you're the best. And I promise to always love you for who you are. You are without a doubt in my mind, my soup snake. And I will always love, cherish, and appreciate you. I love you. Discovered and we see it now